It's time for Please Quit, episode 202. Alright, this is my last day for this week of Gwent in terms of the Gwent weeks. We've got this animated card here where they're beating this guy up from um, those people that I don't play. Alright, new rewards unlocked. It's for later. Alright, so I've got five hours to try and win another match. We'll see what happens with that. And these are whenever. I may get this one. Um, maybe. Alright, we'll see. Hmm, death blow. Well, we're pretty close there. Alright, so let's play. And we'll do a plus one. That was a fun thing, and we've only got 15 hours left to play it anyway. Let's try one more time. So my intention is to um, play two games, one plus one, one normal game. Try to win one of those so I can get my however many half crowns that is, 40 half crowns or whatever. After that, there's more game time today. Go play, um, what's that called? Um, Hitman. Alright. So we've got Botchling. We're going to get rid of that guy. Um, we've got our scenario. We only need two uh, these to play the scenario. We've got her. That's always fun. Um, we've got the baby witcher spawner, which is kind of hard in this game. Um, we'll get rid of that guy. Alright, that gets us to a pretty good place. Let's do this. Alright, I think I'm going to start with Siege. Yeah, that does let him know about the back row, but we're going to let it be. I don't want him to just attack my botchling on first try. I'm going to give um, shield and plus full, or plus, yeah, whatever, to the botch thing. Alright, so we've got this guy only. He's all white. I've seen other versions of this guy before. And he's got the Jernoches, Jernichora's fruit, yeah. Alright, so we're going to be killing these people, interestingly enough. Alright, so let's go ahead and do the botchling, which gives us another botchling. Now we'll give him the power, so it makes him harder to kill, not impossible, of course. Then we'll go ahead and boost our trebuchet, which will now attack them. Alright, so now he's down to just one card. Of course, the Jernichoro's fruit always gives him another extra card. Alright, so he's got these guys that can thrive, which is, uh, right, whenever he plays a higher power unit, that's right. Alright, so, let's go ahead and do, let's do, 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 do let's do the mantlet first. Now we got another mantlet over there. Um, Alright, and let's flip him around to give him some powers. Unfortunately, a bunch of those guys stayed alive, which means um, that they'll get to thrive now. Which means he's building up his, his um, stuff in the back there and potentially keeping me from uh, doing well. <coughs> Alright, I'm going to put Anna right next to him and boost her. That should be useful. Yeah, Thrive is a good one for this. A Thrive deck is good for this mode. Um, Alright, so... Let's throw him up. Alright. Let's put Ana here, which gives us another Ana there. Let's boost her. Alright, so next I'm going to put um, our guy here. Um, let's see. Alright, I'm going to leave him attacking. I'm going to leave him to heal her. Alright, 
All right, let's see where this takes us. I don't, the thing is, if I put my tritum here, I think I don't have room to put my other tritum, unfortunately. Um, that is a bit of a bummer, but yeah, that does give me a full row, which deprives me. All right, I should wait one more turn for this guy to come back. So uh, we'll put this siege engine here, which means he has to take a turn. Um, but we get to bombard him and set off our fireworks. Bring him back. All right, so now, next turn, I can bring in my tritums. Unless he passes, in which case I won't. All right, cool. So I'll pop this guy here and on the other side of her. So now we should be in pretty good shape here. Um, let's see, we'll attack her, and let's see, attack him, and this guy's not going to get to move forward and attack, unfortunately, but that's okay. Um, might as well boost him another one. Alright, we'll leave it at that. Eleven to fifty-two. I'll be surprised if he doesn't pass. Yeah, there we go. All right, so we'll let that go. That'll be a good first round. Let's see if I can get the second round and get the reward I'm looking for. So we still got the Baby Witcher Factory, which is kind of a little bit less useful in this mode. I should probably make. Well, this mode's going to end this week, but I should have probably made a different deck for this mode. All right, that's less useful in this mode. That's less useful, and we're stuck there. All right, I think I will just start off with Bear as my first one. <coughs> and afterwards I'll do Griffin Witcher. Try to do these as quickly as I can before adrenaline kicks in. Very smart uh, unit to play for this round. Very smart. All right, let's do... I think the second one doesn't give bleeding if I put her in, so I think it's better to do Griffin Witcher first. All right. And do I boost him? Yeah, I'll go ahead and boost him. Okay. Alright, these guys are about to eat the crap out of each other. Too bad I don't have um, Geralt, but I can get rid of that guy. Huh, I'm surprised. I thought I was going to boost. Oh, it's when he destroys his own units. I see. Alright. Um, Alright, we'll put this in. Might as well do some bleeding. Alright, and then next we'll do Baby Witcher Factory, so he has time to make a bunch of Baby Witchers. All right, this is getting interesting. All right, so let's get rid of this guy. All right, um, we'll boost him. We will start a baby witcher factory. And then they attack everything, they're locked. Now we've got two baby witchers. What do they actually call it besides baby witcher? <laughs> witcher students. Yeah. All right, this is getting interesting. Uh, too bad I don't have what I need to kill this lizard. Nice. All right, well, we'll see if our baby witcher factory helps. Oh, shoot, we could do this guy. Perfect. Well, not perfect, perfect, but, you know, kind of perfect. All right, hold on, let's see. So this guy eats people. This guy eats people. This guy eats people. These are people to eat. All right, so let's do... It's by two, right? So you, uh, 
you and ah crap come on and you all right cool and now our whole row is full of baby witchers so we can't make any more baby witchers but this will be perfect for boost all allied units by one I know he's trying to check my cards. Come on, dude, don't give me a cheap win. Let's win for real. Eat yourselves, yep, which boosts him. Yeah, this is exciting. Come on, you can do it. Oh, he can't eat because he's on the wrong one or something? I don't know. We'll see. But I can't make any more baby witchers, unfortunately. If only you would kill one of these people in the back here. Uh-oh. That's not good. All right, so... Uh, put this guy up here. All right, and we'll just boost, I don't know, Keldar for no reason. And we'll boost this guy. He's more likely to stay alive. All right, come on, dude, you got... All right, cool, we did have room for another Baby Witcher. Excellent. No more Baby Witchers, though. So this is definitely not the best mode for <laughs> a Baby Witcher factory. But we've got 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17. So plus 17. So this is going to be interesting to see if this guy can um, can beat me. Hey, I got a rat on my side. All right, here we go. Cartoon. All right, 61 of 34. What you got, dude? You might still win. I'm not entirely sure. You still got two cards over me. This is exciting. Hopefully, I make you use up all your cards if you do win this round. Well, you definitely made more room there, which is good. Wish I could kill these people so I can make more Witcher babies. I have a feeling he might pull this off because he's... I don't know what's up with either his or my internet connection. This is ridiculous. That's hilarious. He killed one of my people, but then the baby Witcher factory kicked in and made another Witcher baby to take the spot. <laughs> Alright, dude. Come on. You gotta do this. I'm really upset, though, that I didn't have a Geralt to destroy your plus 16 over there. Ooh, I think I win, unless you do some kind of chain now that makes you win. He's trying. He's checking his cards. I don't think he's gonna be able to do it, though. He came pretty, pretty close. Kaching! All right, victory for me. A straight victory. No need for anyone to cheaply run away. Good game. That was a good game. Boom, boom. All right. Boom, 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 boom. Yeah. All right, I'm 61 now, so if I go to my journey. All right, cool. I got this. I got a few more keys. I got six more keys. Excellent. All right. So let's go see what we can do with all these keys. All right. Four points. All right, so we can get two kegs, or we can get a premium keg. Yeah, let's get two kegs. Boom, and then we'll. Oh, all right, sweet. Plus some meteorite powder, some scraps. All right, we'll go over here. All right, cool. Let's open our kegs. Yup, yup, yup. Yup, yup, yup. Let's go, shoot. Bam. Ugh, cards I already have. And I already have these cards too. So if I was to get another one, would I get the troll -la 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 -la. Mm, 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 mm. I'll do it. I'll go with the catapult. Next keg. Bam. Alright. Got a bunch of those already. I don't know why I have so many bombardments. Alright. Alright, this is the one we have the least of, so we'll do that one. Yeah, I feel like these should be made into scraps. Why do I have so many of those cards? That doesn't make any sense. Sometimes I don't understand the scrapping of this scrapping mechanism in this game. Alright, so if we come over here, these are all done for the next five hours. Uh, if we go to quests here, we've got these. Alright, nothing that really screams at me. Definitely play, so I think I'm just going to let it go. And... Um, yeah, this has been Eric playing Gwent. I'll see you next time. Goodbye.